So it was reported over the weekend that up to 20,000 British citizens will be returning to the UK over the next week or so from service in the IOF. And it appears that unlike in South Africa, where they'll be arrested on return, in the UK, they'll just get a welcome, sir, as they come through immigration. And I find that worrying. And of course, a lot of the comments on Twitter uh, reflected my views, but there were also a hell of a lot of comments from primarily white men with England flags in their bios saying they should be welcomed back with the reception and given medals. And I guess that's no surprise given the level of, of Islamophobia and white supremacist bullshit on the nationalist right wing side of UK society. But I don't think these guys have thought this through because 20,000 is a hell of a lot of well-trained murderous psychopaths to welcome back into a country where their allegiance is to another country. Except with respect to Israel, we wouldn't allow this for one second. Without so much as a debrief, without so much as a, what have you been doing for the last number of weeks? What part of the IOF operations were you in? What did you personally do? What intelligence do you have for us as a country about what our alleged ally is up to? None of that. Just a welcome home, sir, apparently. No concerns expressed. But let me tell you, at the same time as our government is bemoaning the rise of anti-Semitism and, as, and Islamophobia, they're about to, without question, allow 20,000 rabidly Islamophobic people back into society, knowing that a very significant number of those people have participated in ethnic cleansing, genocide, murder, rape, and torture of a largely civilian population, including many, many children and babies. And this is apparently okay. But do you, as an ordinary British citizen, want your neighbor or your colleague at work to, to be somebody you know has voluntarily traveled, used up holiday in order to participate in the current slaughter starvation, genocide, and ethnic cleansing of over 2 million people. If you're okay with that, I'm not okay with you.